Diverticulosis is a common condition affecting the large bowel or colon. Diverticula are out pouchings or little bubbles that develop on the surface of the colon which develop over a period of time as a result of a low fiber diet. This occurs most commonly in the left lower portion of the abdomen in a part of the colon called the sigmoid colon. Diverticula cause problems by bleeding, more commonly by becoming infected resulting in what is known as an attack. Repeated attacks in this part of the colon wears out the colon, causing it to lose its elasticity, become thickened and even more prone to subsequent attacks. At this point, surgery is recommended. Laparoscopically, using only a few small incisions, this portion of the colon can be removed safely, accomplishing this major surgery with only a two-night hospital stay. The mesentery is open to reveal the blood supply to the diseased portion of the colon. The blood supply is clipped and divided. The other attachments to the colon are divided to free the colon. The lower end of the colon is divided at the rectum. A small 2 inch incision is made in the lower abdomen and the diseased portion of the colon is brought up and removed. The top half of a stapling device is then placed in the colon and then the colon is returned into the abdomen. The laparoscopic part of the procedure is resumed. The bottom half of the stapling device is introduced into the rectum. This is coupled with the top half and then deployed, re-establishing the continuity of the colon with the rectum. Laparoscopic surgery can also be used to remove portions of the colon for colon cancer and large polyps.